Hey everyone, my name is Sahil and in today's video, we're going to do a deep dive into understanding cable clients. By the end of this video, you will have a clear understanding of the key differences between single compression and double compression cable clients, their functionality and how to select the appropriate cable gland for your needs. Why should you listen to me talking about cable glands? At Axis, we have manufactured and supplied cable glands across the globe and our glands are installed in international rail projects like Etihad Rail, electricity and water authorities like Deva and Seva and many other electrical facilities. Now, let's start with a fundamental question. What exactly are cable glands? Have you ever noticed how cables safely enter and exit electrical enclosures. The reason for this is a small yet significant component called the cable gland. Cable glands are vital in safeguarding electrical wiring. They protect against moisture, contamination, corrosion and flammable gases, ensuring the cable's safety. Most importantly, they facilitate safe earthing of cables. If you want to learn more about glands, you can read our detailed blog post on the subject the link is in the description. Let's delve into single compression cable glands. A single compression cable gland like this one essentially offers grip or compression at only one place. And that is the cable armor. Typically, these glands are chosen for light armored cables. Their manufacturing process is straightforward, comprising of a threaded body that you can see here, a compression nut and a single compression seal. These glands are suitable for applications require moderate ingress protection and are often selected when there are budget constraints. One of the key advantages is the ease of installation. The process is simple, involving just the insertion of the cable through the gland, tightening the compression nut and securing the cable. This simplicity also makes them more cost effective. You can see the detailed installation of a single compression cable gland over here. However, it's important to note that single compression glands offer less protection against dust, moisture, and other impurities compared to double compression glands. Single compression glands are typically employed indoors or in less demanding environments. Moving on to double compression cable glands. These glands feature two compression seals. First is an inner seal that you can see inside here that grips the cable jacket and the second is an outer seal for additional ingress protection. This dual sealing mechanism significantly enhances protection against dust, water, oil, hazardous gases and other impurities, making them particularly suited for outdoor and harsh environments where robust sealing is essential. These glands are available in various sizes and are ideal for cables up to a thousand square millimeters, including control cables. Double compression glands provide superior cable retention and strain relief. Their dual sealing system ensures a more secure and reliable connection, minimizing the risk of cable pullout or damage. You can see the detailed installation process in this video. Due to their superior sealing capabilities, double compression glands are commonly used in industries such as oil and gas, marine and petrochemicals, mines, and other environments with high exposure to moisture or corrosive substances. However, these glands are approximately 30% longer and more expensive compared to a single compression gland. Which one of these should you choose for your application? Choosing between a single or double compression cable gland depends on the specific needs of your project. If you're working in a low risk environment, a single compression cable gland will be the suitable choice. However, if your project demands higher ingress protection, enhanced reliability, and added support for heavy duty armored cables, a double compression cable gland is recommended. Remember, it's all about understanding the project requirements and ensuring that the selected cable gland is the best fit for your application. This should only be done by an authorized engineer. But do you even know how to select the right cable gland for your cable size? You can watch this following video to learn the correct process.